hello student in this video you learn how you can save a data from java swing application to mysql database okay you observe my design you can design by your own also but in my design i have this first name last name gender email phone number pin code address and with this term suppose this is my patient registration form and i have two button here one is register and one is for this uh, clear button okay once i run this you can see it uh, clearly no? okay and this is my clear button this is my register button okay if i go to the design form now look here okay once i right click here you just need to put a variable you are not confused once you double click here it will take you to the code okay once i double double click here you will see this is my register okay now before we go ahead with the code let me make you clear for this design okay i hope for this uh, taking input from this text field you already learned but for this taking input from this radio button is different it's little tricky but i hope you already follow up with my last video okay if you still confused with this getting input from radio button or combo box you can follow up that previous video then you will know how to bind this normal button with button group and next after the, you design like this and put a variable name for this button you are not confused when you double click here it will take you to the code now before you code this connection keep in mind don't forget to import this library file okay like jsp once you right click on this library folder you will find this add jar once you click on this add jar it will take you to where you it, you can locate where you put this uh, mysql connector okay just uh, import this mysql connector here then once you write this code it will ask you to import this you need to import this um import java sql.star okay if you want uh, if you use only import java.sql.star it means no need this driver manager prepare statement result set if you don't put this star it means you need to import all this uh, all this library file from java swing okay once you import this before your init uh, component you will find here in this connection this i just declare a static variable then we can use in different function so look here this is my static variable i put this uh, uh, this object con and with this uh, prepare statement you'll find this uh, pst and equal null result set rs equal null once you finish to put this one and go back to your register button when you click what you need to write the same code you write in jsp it will not different okay look here this is my database name and this is my uh, username and this is my password so in your in case maybe you don't have a password maybe simply plain here then you can remove this root or maybe it might be another password in your database now getting an input from text field is easy i hope you already know with this you just need to write this string and with this p name you can put any variable name you can put a b c or after that for this uh, radio button likewise i just request you to Oh, follow up the last video then you will know how to group this radio button with a button group then you can use this uh, gender this gender is not come from this normal radio button it mean from the other component it mean from the uh, button group okay you just need to use this get selection dot get action command then it will take you the input it convert them to string now for this uh, get text get text mean all this is a string if you want an integer then you can use this with this integer and this address pin code center when you finish to get all this uh, input from the user then you can uh, write this query this my sql query insert into patient this is my table name if you, if i go to my sql you see this is my table name patient i do have this 10 column but here we'll use only nine because for id i put auto increment one i insert it means it will take a thumb thing okay and another one also i have a different data type this is date for this date also we are not a code we just put this uh, sql center your date then you will got this 
you will get this as date according to your laptop now uh, look here this insert into patient then you can call all this column name all this nine see even this rg date so i call here but i didn't get any variable for rg date i simply put this column name rg date here but for this rg date i just need to write this function this date function c u r d a t date but for the rest you can do same like we have done on jsp even this date also if you want to use in jsp also you can use this date okay now once you finish to write this uh, mysql query then we can prepare a statement for this xql query by calling this pst from where this pst came you might confuse this okay and with this con all of this we already declare before init component okay i already shown you how you can uh, declare this uh, connection and pst variable for your prepare statement okay now you just need to use this same this you can use for update for delete okay and for display also for display for getting a message is successful or not successful you can use a text field or this message dialog box okay for message dialog box we are using a j option pane then with this also once you write a correct center then it will import a automatic this java swing j option p all right though the only thing is different with jsp here you need to put with try okay you need to put this try then after that at the end you can catch the if any error then you will catch the class not found exception otherwise it will not uh, it will make you a uh, error a red color so in order to avoid that you can put with this try and cache so try is before your connection before before calling this connection class and after that this um, class okay for this code you can click a link on the description or comment section of this video then you can copy this code then you can change according to your variable name according to your design okay if you want to follow like this then you can do you need to rename the same like this even with your table also so i hope this uh, video will help you I'll see you in next video thank you